Okay, Dr. Bibbles, can this be the last uh, video, vlog, whatever the fuck um, terminology of the computer world is? Uh, okay, it's May the 21st. If I can get through the, um, if I can get through the last two days without drinking hard liquor, cutting myself, I can get through this day. This day wasn't so bad. Um, actually, it was, but it, uh, sorry if you hear voices in the background, it's PG&E, um, working on the road. So, it's funny how, um, all these, uh, uh, I don't know, tragedies, events, happen years apart, but uh, had like a consecutive uh, three-day period. On the 21st, this one happened around 5.30 this morning when I had the accidental overdose of um, dephenhydramine, of which I uh, eventually drove myself to the hospital like five miles an hour. Um, and surprised I didn't get pulled over because I was driving so slow. But when your pupils get really enlarged, or you can't see your eye color because I was so drugged up on that drug, um, you hallucinate, which I didn't know. So I drove myself to the hospital and I was there for about nine hours. I didn't care how long I was there just because I figured if um, if I was going to die, then I, at least I'd be in the hospital and they could save me or whatever. And that was my fuck up. That was a dumb fuck up. If I would have died then, um, I know I'm suicidal, but I, I didn't mean to die then. So it would have been my fuck up. And... Um, but your lovely brother, Lugosi, when he brought me poison oak, yes, you can get poison oak from your cats. Uh, that was just awful. I um, was just covered in it because your brother's an affection addict. Because when he was born, who was all black, I treated him like the second coming of Christ because I just lost my black cat, um, Lego, uh, sinister. And then the firstborn of Tank's, uh, litter, not Tank's litter, Bella, but the firstborn was a black cat. So in my thoughts, it was uh, sinister being reincarnated. So I put all my effort into your older brother, but in the end, it was you, my dear, who stole my heart. Oh, uh, yeah. But, um, here you go. Remember this? Cats love it. And, um, so, I barely made it through that. But, um, I survived it. I'm surprised. But, um, that's why it's it's not very depressing today. I don't feel like I have to cut myself or uh, drink car liquor to escape it. Because um, in the end, I was just happy that I survived it. Though I'm suicidal, but I wasn't meaning to die then. Uh, this only happened a couple of years ago. And, um, uh, yes. Um... To the officers that are subscribers, um, it sounded like in a, a video to you guys that I said I had multiple personalities. I don't have multiple personalities. I was actually diagnosed borderline and bipolar. Um, I just know I probably have some additional personality disorders on top of the borderline. And with the head injuries... Uh, happened when I was young. Um, first one was frontal lobe. That's why I'm so violent. 
And the second one, I don't know. It was a concussion. And um, who knows what the fuck that did to me. But um, it was... I was young, so they... Um, my parents didn't do any neurological testing after those injuries. Which they probably should have, but they didn't. Um, and... So my whole life, I've always felt fucked up, mentally fucked up. And that was probably the ultimate reason. Um, it's because of those head injuries. Uh, when I uh, get triggered into a mood, I never know what disability uh, comes out. I don't know if it's my borderline, my bipolar, my head injuries. I never know. Maybe it's a mix of all three. I used to go to a, a TBI group, which is a traumatic brain injury group. And the other patients there kept saying, or, you know, um, they, w they missed who they used to be. Um, and I'd hate to feel that way. I'd hate to feel that way. Um, always missing who I used to be because I've always, in my eyes, been f fucked up. So I couldn't relate to that, but I'm just glad I don't have to feel that way. Um, but anyhow, um, so yes, officers, oh, your brother's safe. He was all black, fluffy, older brother, but he was, he's all safe, uh, with the neighbors back in California. So... I'm hoping this will be the last made post because after today there is no other uh, tragedies that happened this month. So, you're so pretty. And, um, yeah. In the end, I was just happy I survived the overdose. So it took me the rest of the year to uh, recuperate from that. I keep, forget I keep forgetting to mention in 2009, in between sinister death and your birth, my father died of Alzheimer's. So that was actually the worst year of my life. I cannot stand 2009. But then it turned really good, just in the very end, because... You, uh, you guys were born. So, cats also like, uh, paper towel rolls. And, um, okay. I just gotta get through this day. But, um, everyone have a lovely day. And this will be a first for me. Not turning to hard liquor cutting myself, so your behavior can change if you, um, I don't know, if you try. You don't have to uh, do the same actions, destructive actions, uh, all the time. So, we'll just get through this day, and, uh, oh my god, look how gorgeous you are. And get through the uh, rest of this month. And hopefully next time we'll be happier. How's that sound, Pebbles? <gasps> and, uh, yeah. Cats love um, milk jug things or water things. He does. Okay. Everyone had a great, have a great day. And, uh... Yeah. <sighs>